I don't know. Do you want me to show you this piece? Yeah, sure. Crushing me a little bit. Yeah, I just need. Yeah, almost there, right? I feel like we're we have a job in Mississauga, a job in Toronto, a job in Coburg, and uh, a job in Peterborough going. <laughs> no, that that one in Aurelia there kind of crushed me a little bit. I talked to the homeowner; he's cool, but it's just like fuck. So. That's the piece there. Oh, yeah. It came with the other pieces, so it matches perfectly. But there's lots of length there. Okay, good. That'll, Maybe that'll you work. could put that in the middle, like trim it down, put it in the middle, and then hopefully the other pieces will allow you to cut. Do you know what I'm getting at? I, I hear you. I just hope it li everything lines up with the brackets, because that's what it's... Oh. They're so tricky to get. Yeah, I and see We what can you're move saying. brackets around, too, with a piece that big. Yeah. But, uh, and then boom. Mike said... He wants to drill these into the concrete so i don't know if you're comfortable doing that or if you want to do it or he said he'd get his pool guy to do it after we're done whatever he wants if he wants us to do we can do it he said we could do it so just let me know what it uh what your cost is on it and then i'll just pass i'll get jack to send it to yeah, the, line up the liner and make sure everything's good well i guess the holes are going to be drilled since it's pretty straightforward here yeah it well you took it out in order right it did, yes yeah Perfect. We did. I photographed it all. Good. Documented, photographed. Ray's crazy concrete system here. Like, Good work, Ray. Yeah. I'm like, you don't want to fit in for me? He's like, no, no, I like this better. I'm like, okay. Here we're just going to use the. I'm going to build a little. Just use a laser level. That's a good idea. What are we going to form? Nice. Form like a grass. Yeah, just use a laser level. Same down the end. I was hoping if that piece can go in the center, it'll shout like there's more than enough now to hopefully get rid of the. Yeah. So if I this one push together and stay. But I bet that piece that piece is this long. But I bet if you were to take those two out and then cut them, yeah. But here. No. This one's doing nothing here. Yeah. This one's way overstretched. Oh, they got one in the center. Oh, okay, this one, yeah. But this one, I need to... I need to do a third. Because these way. pieces, too, they need to... Do they need to go out a bit farther? This one's hanging. This one's hanging over the motor. So this, this needs a bracket right here. Yeah. Time of the year, man. So I was like, I feel like I'm not busy, but I am. Yeah. But I always, I'm like, ah, we're not busy. And I'm like, I don't know. We got like four jobs, and we're moving 500 loads of fill, and I got all like all the bin trucks. I'm like, I feel like maybe, but I always feel like we're not busy. Though. Necropolis, it's all finished, but they got to build a fence. Well, I don't want to saw it because they're going to be tromping all over the saw it until we build the until we build the fence. So I'm like, we'll have to leave and then remobilize, which is fine. It was part of the job from the beginning, but it's like it's just I'm like, man, man, we could wish we could have just laid this fucking three skids of sod in half a day and been out of here. But if we do that, and then that fucks the fence guy, and he's got to work on both sides, and then it, you know he puts footprints in it, and then you go back anyways to fucking fix it because you fucked the guy. It's fucking way better to just. Billy's here today, and then Jesse will be here with him tomorrow. Okay, we got a lot of work. We got concrete piece for you guys. He doesn't have a pair. He does not have a pair. I have a whole bag. Nice. 
Give them a set of concrete boots. They'll love that. I have. I had a few pairs, and then I bought a bunch of those Canadian Tire ones. Oh, okay. Five sets of them. He said to me, "What's my purpose here today?" I said, "Do whatever Tyler needs you to do. That's Wheel your barrel. that's really your purpose today." Wheel barrel these two sides. That, what time is the concrete coming? We start bringing this in like 20 minutes. Start bringing this forward a little bit. It's like we're kind of organizing a bit right beside. So tomorrow it's just nice. This is going to be the most labor intensive part. I think. These brackets are just yeah. Because I think we're, we're going to end up having to probably strip the sod too to get it on the right level, which is part of it. Yeah, whatever. Ooh, a little. So on that side, it actually looks right here. We might be high. We'll see. No matter what, we'll clean it up. And... That's fine. Yeah. These guys love sod. Nobody loves sod. We got three skids on Monday. Nobody loves sod. I wish I had a good sod guy. Uh, so we've been we've been using. Well, it depends what the volume is, but we've been using Windermere sod. Yeah. He's great. He did, this, he did the whole. He did the. Um, he did the Kenny Museum for us, but he even went up for like two skids at the end. Because I didn't want to, I was like, man, I gotta send the guys back. And then I was like, okay, I don't have to send them back. So, so psychologically, in the end, it's just nobody wants to do it, yep. including myself. I feel they, you. They look at me and they're like, he doesn't want to do it. So <laughs> Why would we want to do it? <laughs> Why would we want to do it? Yeah. What concrete company is coming? Uh, St. Mary's. Nice. Sometimes you get like a small town ready mix guy who's got like one truck. Yeah. A mix on site. I like that stuff as much. I used the uh, They're having a mix. Oh, UPLP? Yeah. UPLP. Concrete near me. Concrete near me. Which actually worked out great because it was uh, the long weekend. Oh, yeah. And my I was supposed to do it that Saturday. I didn't get there. So I messaged him on Instagram. He, was, he had everything set up for two weeks. Really? Yeah, it was awesome. I could have asked for a bit. I think we're going to have to do a roll, maybe, which is fine. We were pretty careful, obviously you got a little spillage just yeah. from the buggy. Yeah, that's alright. None of the pool lines got messed up, so... Once this is all done, we can just rake that shit back into the hole and then we'll sod it. We'll strip it, sod it, and... Fucking perfect, Tyler. Okay, I gotta get rolling. Alright, have a good day, brother. I'm out of here. You're good? Yeah. Alright, later Thanks bro. Good. Yeah. Have a good one. Yeah. I'll, I'll update your schedule for what I need you to pick up tomorrow. Okay. Thanks man. Yeah.